Guys, good morning, happy new year. It is a new year. I'm ready to tackle 2021, and that's just period. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Make sure, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you're oldie, hey girl, hey, welcome back to another video. Y'all already know what the deal is. It's Sunday, and it's time for me to fix my coffee. sip of coffee it's so freaking good y'all it's looking at this camera honey make me remember about the quality that's with this baby okay it's so pretty outside today can y'all see you can't really tell but it is so pretty outside I really need to clean you know like really really clean but first i need to take the trash out i hate taking this fucking trash out like it be too cold one but it gotta get done At this point, I'm actually about to start getting concerned because I literally just looked at my car because I took the trash out. And I also, I'm looking downstairs. Y'all didn't look hard enough. Didn't look hard enough. <laughs> I was about to get on here and lie. <laughs> like, for real. Like, I really didn't look hard enough. So I have my camera right here. But I think I'm just going to finish this video out on the Canon G7X just to see if I still like it or whatever because I am thinking about selling this camera um it'll come with like some SD cards the good kind like the 64 or whatever and then it'll come with like three batteries a plug-in chart you know a charger thingy to plug into the wall so it'll come with a lot of stuff with it but it's like, do I keep it for a backup or do I actually sell it? Because I now have three cameras. Because if you've been rocking with me, you know that I used to like post like videos of me doing my makeup and stuff like this. I make up videos. So I had the Canon T5i and I have like two different lenses for that. I have so many backdrops, but I know I probably will never record beauty videos like that again because I really don't like them like that. In case I, you know, start incorporating me doing my client's makeup or whatever, then I could use it. But then again, this camera is good and my Sony camera is good. So it's like, do I sell that one or do I sell this one? So it's like, I don't know. But if I do decide to sell it, I'll let you guys know. Because I know a lot of people want to start YouTube channels or whatever. And they want like a good camera. And of course, it's not going to be super expensive. Because I mean, it does have some wear and tear on it or whatever. But as you can see, like the focus and everything is still fire. So, um... Yeah, but just to, you know, sell it. Because I feel like I have too many electronics, you know what I'm saying? Like, too many that I really don't even use like that. So, it's like, what's the point? You know what I mean? So, yeah. But, look at my living room. I really need to clean all this up. My son and all this mess. This is my vision board that I have to do. I'm probably going to do it sometime this weekend. I think me and Jean are going to do it together. I really need to put this to the side because my son already bent this part and I don't even know how he did that but yeah so I need to put this to the side because I don't want it to be messed up and I need to do this so I can plan my year out you know oh yeah guys so my boss and my job we have these little heads so with these heads or whatever you can actually practice where you mark each um, area that you know you have to put the wires and stuff in so she let me borrow this because as you guys know my test is coming up and since I have not been at work since I have not been at work I know it's gonna take like some adjustment you know what I'm saying to like kind of get back used to it or whatever to try to like remember like the hands-on part 
you know, it was kind of different with me working um, and trying to study for my test because I still had hands-on training. But the fact that I have not been working in like five months at the sleep lab, no, it's been five months because I think it was like August. It's like, I kind of remember stuff, but then again, I don't remember anything. So I stopped by and she gave me that to be able to practice, put my um, electrodes and stuff or whatever and you know, make sure I'm doing the correct measurements because I know for a fact when I took my registry, it was questions about the head on there. So yeah, but that right there is a must if you need help or whatever practice or whatever use one of them you can always use a wig head any kind of mannequin head you can use it doesn't matter but that will help you out on learning like the correct placements for the 1020 hookup So like, you see me? My son got an Xbox for Christmas, but I'm honestly really thinking about um, moving it upstairs to his room because I feel like it's taking too much in my living room. And like now I'm like into the point where I don't really like that much stuff. Like y'all just don't understand, like I really want to take my kitchen table out the kitchen so freaking bad because I feel like I don't have any room and I really don't right now i need it but hopefully when i do move into a house or whatever or to another you know apartment it have like a, a island thingy a little bar because i don't like kitchen tables right now i don't like kitchen tables maybe when i do get a house i can get me a big beautiful kitchen table and it decorated pretty but as of right now living in an apartment i really don't want one so yeah so but anyways besides that <laughs> i think about moving his xbox upstairs to his room so that's what I'm probably gonna end up doing when he actually wakes up. He's still asleep right now. But I think I am gonna do that. So I'm probably gonna go ahead and plug everything. Yes, okay, so. This is the first cleaner that I use. That's the Cinema Secrets Pro, Cos um, Pro Cosmetic. And it's quick drying, so to all my MUAs. I know y'all probably know because this is just like not even new. But I love this stuff. I like to take it on the road or whatever. But usually I'll put like in a, a little container like this and I got it labeled. So, you know, Jean would like, but no, not to use this to spray it on anything else. But, so I put it in this cup right here and these are the brushes that I have to get clean. I usually just clean it. Use, I usually use this to clean like my small brushes. The big brushes I actually use like Iris Spring Soap and Baby Shampoo gets the job done every time. I like to use these on my small brushes so that's what I'm about to get ready to do now. <laughs> you guys exactly what I was talking about but you can't really see it I don't think so I cleaned all of my brushes right here in literally like 10 minutes I cleaned all those brushes and I want to show you guys my nails so that's like a little kit from Walmart or whatever I have makeup and stuff on my nails right now but it's like a little kit from Walmart that I got it's like a gel kit and I did my nails I did a natural kind. It comes with like the natural nails and it comes with the white tip. I did the natural ones or whatever, but 
I wanted to paint those a color, but it didn't turn out right. So I ended up taking those off and going with the French tip. I haven't had French tip in a long time. When I do, it usually be those little gel sticky nails, but I decided to give these a try again. It is 119 and I put some pizza in the oven that I bought yesterday. So we're gonna have pizza for lunch. And then I'm probably gonna get some more studying in while I'm like up and hyped or whatever. So that's the move. For right now, I'm sorry that I'm bright. I am about to look over some notes and study a good bit. It is 1.46. I'm gonna set my timer for two hours. Yeah, I need to make some copies. Um, I like to use these kind of pens when I'm taking my notes. I got these from Amazon. It's just different varieties of colors that I like to use, but this they look like I'm just gonna focus. See. The Canon does not focus like the Sony. That's the only thing that I don't really like about it. But I like to come in my own office and I lit a candle with the natural light coming in. I got my water right here because I feel like I've been really dehydrated lately. But that's what I'm about to get ready to do. So I like to always put on me some music to listen to. Like I always like to listen to gospel music. Let me tell y'all, Leandra Johnson. Radio station on Pandora. If you like gospel, it'll give you gospel, but then it'll turn around and give you R&B, but then it'll throw a little bit of rap in there too. So it's like a variety of everything that you can get within one radio station. So I'm gonna turn on my Pandora and let my phone charge up and get in steady mode and just get my mind together. You know what I'm saying? It's grind time, people. It's 2021. Like I can't, I, I gotta quit sleeping on myself. Like I can't keep doing it, okay? Uh, but y'all my face is breaking out really bad i have like marks right here right there on my forehead my chin like my skin is really trash right now and y'all know how i am about my skin i think it's because i'm stressing because of my test so my face is like really 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 acting out so we need to do something about that so i'm gonna do me a mask the favorite one my favorite one that i like to do as of right now is the ordinary one it's simply this right here this one right here miss girl like <laughs> this g7x yo makes me really appreciate the autofocus on the sony okay but this mask i'm gonna do this one first okay in between time while i'm like taking a break from studying like this is crazy. Focus it more like in the areas that I feel that I'm breaking out. I have not been taking my probiotics as well. Like your girl has been really, 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 really stressed out. Like stressed because I'm ready to pass this test so I can get back to work. Gonna set it for 10 minutes and uh, yeah, I think I'm like, I, oh, I want to show y'all something. Let me show y'all something. I'm show y'all this website just in case you guys want to take the certification. Okay, I'm going to show y'all what i been practicing with so you guys could know. Because I get a lot of people asking me questions and I don't want y'all to feel like I'm ignoring y'all. But I, hell, I'm trying to learn this just as well as y'all. Like, I can't give you no set answer or response on something because I have not passed my test yet. So... I mean, I don't know what more I could say because I haven't passed my test yet. But when I pass my test, you know I got y'all. I got y'all. You know I'm here, y'all. So what you want to do is you want to simply 
you want to type in CP, um, CPSGT practice exam. You want to go to the one that's pro proofs and click on it. And this is the test that I, I started out taking with. So I took my notes on it or whatever, but I still come back and like take it every now and need to see do I know it. But it simply, you know, asks you questions to give you a whatever, a thing that you should choose from. And it'll tell you if your answer is correct or not. And I also give you where you can print off a certificate at the end. It's 50 questions. So this is something that you can use that will help you study. So all you basically have to do, of course, is just read that question. What would increase the resolution of EEG spikes and improve the definition of high frequency activity? You can put the recording sampling rate because that's the answer. And boom, it tell you correct. And it lets you know all the questions right here, the unanswered ones and answered. So I've answered one and I have 49 left. And total is 50. This is one thing that I'm actually doing to help me, you know, learn a few other things that I need to know. But I also have my notes as well. And I also have my other stuff that I use to take the registry or whatever that one time that I did take it. So, yeah, that's what you can do. So, I'm going to try, I'm going to do this practice quiz, you know, just to take it or whatever. While I'm um, waiting on the timer to go off, I have six minutes left. So, I'm going to do this and then I'm going to come back to you guys and show you guys what um i made so as you can see i finished the test so i'm gonna click view my results and period so it said that i made 100 out of 100 on this little practice test that has a lot of the aasm stuff on there if you want to like take that and because you know you have to learn like the recommended instead of what your actual sleep lab prefers so it has a lot of the questions from the aasm so i feel like it might be helpful for the test who knows but of course i'm gonna let you guys know so, as you guys just saw, I made me some hot tea. I follow up by putting some Vaseline and stuff on my face. The mask, it did okay. Or whatever. It wasn't... Mm, I mean, it made my skin feel like it was softer. You know what I mean? Um, And it kind of took some of the texture away that I had in my skin. But, of course, I did not expect it to just take away my pimples within just first use. You know what I mean? I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that notification bell. So, you can be well aware when you're going to upload a video. But... Um, I'm about to take me a break right now. I'm about to drink my tea and edit this vlog because I need this vlog to go up tomorrow and probably watch something on Netflix and then pick back up the books later on. But I just want to come in and close out this video. I will see you guys in my next video, guys.